Hello everybody. Welcome to Everyday English number four. And today we're going to talk about going to a restaurant and ordering. Let's begin with types of restaurants. Let's start with fast food. And the name describes it. It's fast, but not fancy. You order at a counter, disposable utensils. And many of these places will have a drive through A diner. This is a very American institution. Very informal, serves a variety of moderately priced items. And the word diner can also describe the person who is eating. Fast casual, a step up from fast food. Food is served on real dishes, but doesn't usually offer full table service. Moderately priced food. Think Panera Bread. Casual, usually full table service, moderately priced food. Think Applebee's. Buffet. You serve yourself. Usually it's all you can eat. Think Golden Corral. Fine dining. Now they're going to be more expensive restaurants. Um, the tables will probably have nice linen tablecloths. They may have a dress code. May require reservation. We usually eat here for special occasions. Ethnic. These are restaurants that serve food from different countries. This picture shows Hella's Greek restaurant in Tarpon Springs, Florida, and becoming more and more popular food trucks, restaurants on wheels. Food court, many restaurants located in one place. Okay, let's look at some at the restaurant vocabulary. Hostess, greet you, ask if you have reservations, how many in your party, tells you the wait time, and then will escort you to your table. She may give you a pager to notify you when your table is ready. Bus boy or busser. This is a person who cleans off the table. Would you like a table or a booth? Many restaurants have a full service bar. Menu. All the things that can be ordered at a restaurant. Kids menu. Happy hour. That's reduced prices on alcoholic beverages at certain times. Daily specials. Early bird specials. Reduce prices for early diners. Waiter for a man, waitress for a woman, and server is gender neutral. Starters, appetizers, or apps. A la carte means everything is ordered separately. Vegetables, main dish, etc. Wine list. Beverages or drinks. Main course, the main part of your meal, might be chicken, beef, seafood, or vegetarian. Sometimes we refer to the main course as the entree. If you order a beef dish like the steak, the server will ask you, how do you want it cooked? Rare, medium rare, medium, medium well, or well done. And sometimes if you order a fish dish, the server will ask you, how do you want it cooked? Fried, baked, grilled, blackened are all options. Sometimes if you order a potato, you'll have options mashed, baked, or french fries. Order a salad. What kind of dressing would you like? There are many different flavors. French, blue cheese, ranch, Italian. House is one made at that specific restaurant. Soup. Chowder. Thicker than soup. This is clam chowder. Rolls. A lot of meals will come with rolls or bread. Sides. Mashed potatoes, green beans, mac and cheese, corn. Desserts. Something sweet after the meal. Doggy or to-go bag or box. A container to take your leftovers home. Check or bill. Tip or gratuity. Money left for service. In the United States, 15% is expected. What the server might say. Is this all on one check? Would you like a starter? What would you like to drink? Our special today is, how would you like that cooked? That comes with two sides. What would you like? Would you like soup or salad? What kind of dressing? Can I get you some more iced tea? Room for dessert? Do you need a box? Here is your bill. I will take it to the cashier whenever you are ready. 
Thank you for dining at Casa Vincenzo Pelotti. What the diner might say. Separate checks, we are going Dutch. Dutch is a slam for paying separately. May I substitute? Change something. I would like it well done. Salad with ranch dressing, please. Could we get some more rolls? We will need a box. Could we have the bill, please? Listen and learn. A welcome to Casa di Vincenzo Palotti. My name is Luigi. I will be your server. Our special today is a baked manicotti. Would you like an antipasto? Yes, I will have the small antipasto plate. Would you like something to drink? I will have a red wine. A bono. And it's a happy hour. You will want the both glasses of vino at the same time? That will be great. Bono. I'll bring you your vino and I place the order for the antipasti. Excuse me, are you ready to order? I will have the Toscan steak. And how do you want it cooked? Well done, please. That it comes with two sides. It also comes with the garlic bread. I will have pasta marinera and minestrone. Here is your meal. Bon appetito. Thank you. Room for dessert. We have a cannoli, pizza chocolate, and tiramisu. Mmm, I love tiramisu. A bono. A cup of coffee, espresso? Espresso, please. I'll take that whenever you are ready. Ciao and grazie. Okay, let's have some fun with idioms. Ciao, food. Ciao hound, one who likes food. A chow down means to eat. Clean your plate means you eat everything. Dine and dash. Eat and leave without pain. Foodie, someone who loves food. They love to cook. They love to try new things. Double dip, putting a half-eaten chip back in the dip. Not a good thing. Greasy Spoon, a restaurant that's not too fancy. Maybe serves unhealthy food, but tasty food. Pig, one who eats a lot of food. Pig out, eating a lot of food. Put the feed bag on means you're ready to eat. I could eat a horse. I am really hungry. Comfort food. Food that brings back really good memories. 